What's up guys, Tree Huggins here, and today we're going to be playing a game called Kindergarten. It is a Steam game, so it's on PC. Um, the only thing that I know about it is the objective is you go to school in kindergarten and you're trying not to die. So, uh, this first screen says, it looks like you haven't played before. Would you like to go through the tutorial? Um, and I believe I would like to go through the tutorial. Okay, so welcome to kindergarten. The school day is separated into five separate time intervals. The schoolyard, morning time, lunch, recess, and show and tell. Most characters want something done during the day. Try and pick one character to help each day. Completing a character's task all the way will unlock that character's special item. Special items can be reused infinitely. Every day is exactly the same as the one before. It is always Monday. Only money and special items are saved from day to day. Characters will respond differently to you depending on what items you have and what decisions you have made throughout the day. On screen elements. Use spacebar. Okay, so on the left we have money. The amount of money you're currently carrying. The middle items in your inventory will appear here, and apples represent how many actions you can take in a room. This is some example dialogue for the tutorial. This person currently is speaking. This is what the person's saying. These are possible responses to what the character is saying. Um... So, such as, this response requires an item in order to be selected. This response requires one dollar to be selected. This response will use an apple if selected. Controls. So, it's the it's the generic uh, WASD to move. Space bar, mouse, left mouse click to interact. The people and objects. Use enter slash return to use an apple and pick up 25 cents. Use backslash... Backward slash to open your planner, and then use escape to pause. Controls can be reconfigured from the options menu. Tips. Once you are all out of apples, the bell will ring and you will have to move to the next area. If you are outside of the area you started in, the bell will ring when you have one apple left. If you can't find a way to use all your apples, use enter to consume the rest of them and continue to the next area. So so, okay, take a look at the hints page. Some hints are unlocked already. So, okay. Am I ready to start another day of kindergarten? Yes, I am. So, screw off, kid. I'm busy screw off. Hi, my friends call me Nugget, or they would if I had any. Nugget knows no love or friendship. Since Billy went missing, I'll be your friend. What happened to Billy? You get none from me. I'll be your friend. What is your offering? I have only, I only have friendship. Offering? I only have friendship. Heh. <laughs> Perhaps that is all Nugget needs. You may have Nugget's Nugget. It signifies our friendship. Uh, thanks. Do not consume the nugget of friendship. It is with, for with its digestion, so too is our friendship digested. I won't. Good. Nugget will see you later, friend. Sure. No more talking now. Shoo. Okay. Go talk to this girl. Hey there, cutie. I'm Cindy. Want to be my boyfriend? Uh, no. Okay, Cindy. Hey there, cutie. I'm Cindy. Want to be my boyfriend? Uh, sh sure. Uh, I will, yeah. Heh, that's what I like to hear. And we'll totally be the cutest couple at school. But first, you have to do something for me. Like what? You see that girl over there? That's Lily. She's by far the ugliest, nastiest girl you will ever meet. I want you to take this gum and stick it in her hair during the morning time. Got it? Yeah, I can do that. Oh, yeah. This is going to be so great. She'll finally get what she deserves. Just like her brother did for dumping me. Come find me for morning time after you've done it. What happened to her brother? 
You haven't heard? He went missing. His disappearance totally stole the thunder from my dog, Biscuit, going missing. I guess everyone just cares more about him than they do about me. Your dog went missing too? I care about you. Yep, that's what you're... <laughs> that's why you're going to stick gum in that... Oh my gosh. Yeah, that's why you're going to stick that gum in Lily's hair during morning time. Come see me after you've done it. Is this Lily? That's Lily, right? Oh. Um, hey, I'm Lily. You probably heard about what happened to my brother, Billy. I haven't. You haven't? It's been all over the news. He went missing a few days ago. Sorry to hear that. Thanks. That makes you one of the few people that even seems to care. Ever since he went missing, people either ignore me or insult me. Cindy has been trying to put gum in my hair. Yeah, I know. She gave this to you? Wow, she can't even do her own dirty work? I'm ugly enough without having gum in my hair, so thanks for not doing it. You're not ugly. Oh, thanks. I guess Sydney has been getting me to me lately. I appreciate the compliment. You're nice. Thanks. I'm not really looking to be friends right now, but I do trust you. For whatever that's worth. I'll see you around. Sure. <sighs> I'm Monty. If you need something, come talk to me. Odds are that I can get it for you the right price. What I need and what I sell changes uh, throughout the day. So come see me often. I want to buy something. I want to sell something. I don't want anything. Okay, cool. And... I'm Jerome. I don't think you're cool enough to talk to me. Whatever, jerk. Okay. How you doing there, Sonny? Don't mind the old janitor here just sweeping up after you silly cretins. <laughs> sweepy, sweepy, sweepy. That's a mop. Stop talking to the creep janitor. That's a mop. Ah, so it is. You're also mopping the sidewalk. I'll be mopping your blood off if you don't skedaddle. I don't want to skedaddle. I'm a man of my word. You gonna kill me? And he killed me. <laughs> you died. Don't take the janitor's warnings lightly. Okay, children, it's time to start the day! Everyone had it time for more at time! Go inside. Good morning, children! It's time for you to pick your buddies for morning time! Or you can be sad, pathetic, and alone. As long as you're the best you, you can be. Go find a partner. Um, I'm gonna pick Jerome. He seems cool. Dude! You know you're not cool enough to talk to me. Let alone be my morning buddy. Besides, Monty is going to help me up with a sweet yo-yo. What of a jerk. What's up, girl? Oh, hey. I'm glad you were nice to me this morning and all. We're not really looking for a morning buddy right now. Okay. Trick. Why the hell do you think I would want to be your morning buddy? Good point. Uh, can I steal this? Hey! Don't go snooping around in other people's cubbies. So, girl, well, what are you waiting for? Stick the gum in her hair. I already told her what you were going to do. Ah, oh, man, why'd you have to do that? Whatever. I guess you don't have what it takes to be my boyfriend. We're through. Go away. Fine. So, bro, Nugget does not wish to spend morning time with you. Nugget is very busy. What are you busy with? You are curious about the ways of Nugget? Interesting. Perhaps you could be of some use to Nugget. Perhaps. Nugget is in need of a magnifying glass. Do this for Nugget before the next bell rings, and you will be rewarded. Okay, I guess. What? You want to be my morning buddy? I ain't got time for that nonsense, so unless you're buying or selling something, get lost. I don't want anything. Looks like I don't have a buddy. Go find a morning buddy, or you'll be an outcast loser like Nugget. Um, okay. Don't talk to me anymore. Oh my gosh, nobody wants to be my partner.
Ah. So I'm going to buy the yo-yo and give it to Jerome and hopefully that will make him be my friend. Okay. Else? Okay, Jerome. Dude, you're not cool enough. Oh, you mean this yo-yo? Oh, come on. It's only who's going to say that for me. You can have it if you'll be my buddy. Heh. Thanks, chump. I guess you haven't learned how to tell time yet. Morning time is pretty much over. Oh. Good lord. I need that magnifying glass for a nugget. Okay. Oh, good lord. I'm not going to be able to come up this room. <laughs> okay, excitement failed. You know we're near cool enough to sit with us. Get lost. I don't want to sit with you anyway. That's kind of a jerk. No way a worm like you was going to be sitting with me. Okay, Cindy probably hates me, so that's fine. Sorry, sweetie. We're through. Better luck tomorrow. Nugget. No, oh, that's not. Something's not good. I don't think anyone is brave enough to try a biscuit from the janitor. Old well, man can't even spell it right. No. Nugget. No one ever says support Nugget. Nugget does not have any friends. Walk away from Nugget. Oh my god. Come on, people. Okay, no one wants to sit with me. How are you doing there, Sonny? Want some tasty, nutritious slop for lunch? Uh, what's in it? It's an old family recipe. Lots of herbs and spices and salt and about 89% the principal secret ingredient. 89% is a lot. Oh, it's not that much. Supposedly it keeps the slop in regulation with the government's new health standards. What's the secret ingredient? I can't tell you that. It's a secret. Also, I have no idea what it is either. You feeling a seasoned mystery ingredient? But the seasoning is so good. It's the best part. I'm not eating it. Got anything else? Well, the menu is kind of restricted right now. With uh, the new health restrictions. Sorry, regulations. I have a chocolate bar, but it's pretty darn expensive. Ten dollars? Why is it so expensive? It's all part of the government wanting you kids to be less fat. You poor things are wasting away for my eyes. Never mind then. Yeah, just give me it. Uh, can I go to the bathroom? Oh, I'm not allowed to let any of you kids out in the hallway in your life, but maybe you could do me a little something you want to go the other way? Well, I seem to have misplaced my glasses. These old eyes can't read the menu without them. See if you can find a pair lying around and I'll let you out. Uh, okay. Well, that mopey little girl has been paying me to let her out. I don't see why you can't get the same deal. Two dollars? Are you kidding me? 
I'll just try to find the glasses. You want me to the trash? No, it's a garbage can. I'm not gonna dig through it to find stuff. Walk away. Okay. Sophia's glasses. Never mind. Maybe still talk to me. I'm gonna try to leave. Hey, stop! I can't leave when the lunch is over. Biscuit balls, get your biscuit balls here. Get them while they're hot. You spelled biscuit wrong? What? No, I didn't. How do you even know? You can't even read. Monty can. Ugh, is that the toy with the glasses? Who am I kidding? Of course it is. Hey, nerd. Ooh, glasses are gonna fall off. Um, what do you want? Got some jaded stuff you wanna sell me? No, but I got a coffin for you to buy. <coughs> and his glasses! Oh, yeah. That must be a lesson to you about correcting people's spelling! There! That kid's dead, guys! Oh my gosh! There! Lessons were learned! Lines were drawn! Did he just step on those glasses? He just took the glasses. Oh, God. You're a kid. You're a good kid for letting me know a lot of monsters go around correct spelling in a school of all places. Shameful the way kids turn out these days. Is he dead? What? No! I just hit him until he got all twitchy. He'll be fine in a year or two. That's a long time. You just get the old janitor to know... Uh, uh, you just let the old janitor know if anyone else has anything to say about his spelling. I don't think that will happen again. Oh, these glasses flew off the nerd's face when I hit him. You can have them. These old eyes don't miss a thing. Right, thanks. And now I'm going to give him to her. Uh, can I go to the bathroom? Okay. Well, I found some glasses. Oh, lovely. Thanks so much. Go ahead and do what you gotta do. I won't stop you. Okay, good. I'm gonna go talk to my shorty. Hey. Hey, girl. Go away, kid. I'm in trouble with principal. Here's you. Uh, Lily, what is your deal? I need something to unscrew it with a screwdriver. I need a screwdriver. This is the door of the insurance closet. It's locked. Bathroom. Oh, huh? You! You're not supposed to be in here. I gotta take you to the principal. That is, unless. Unless what? Well, I'm out of cigarettes. If you had some, I'd be willing to let you off. I don't. Major Bummer Man looks like we gotta go visit the principal. Aw, oh, man. You can't just be running around the school during lunch. You should know better. I'm sorry. Me too. Me too. Why are you sorry? Oh shoot, he just shot me! The hall monitor will catch you if you go to the bathroom without cigarettes. I'll return home. Okay. Man, this is such an intense, like, game. It's, it's really well done, I would say. There's a lot of intricacies that I'm just not familiar with, but I really enjoyed it. I think I'm going to stop there, though. Um, thank you guys so much for watching. I know this is a different game. It's kind of weird, uh, but it was kind of fun to play. Uh, I might play it intermittently. Uh, I might play it again. I don't know. You guys tell me. Did you like it? Is it a good weird or just did it turn you off? Did you not like it? Because there are little kids dying. I don't know. Um... If you're not subscribed, please subscribe, um, tell your friends, uh, leave a comment, like the video if you liked it, and as I tell my students, please make good choices!